And here were the Heat coming into the building earlier on, looking as dapper as ever. Their goal, as always, protect their home court. And the game arrivals, sponsored by Express. Dress like a pro. Coming to you tonight from the American Airlines Arena with a look high above here in Miami. Welcome, everyone. The regular season is in the books. The battle for the East begins. Round one, game one. Along with Steve Smith and Greg Anthony, this is Kevin Harlan. And our friend on the sideline, Hall of Famer David Aldridge, who we'll be hearing from shortly. Hey, Dave. Well, Victor Oladipo has a huge task and a long road in front of him making his way back from that knee injury. But you talk to his teammates, and they rave about his mental makeup. They say he's an incredible person, great to be around, the most positive guy they've ever played with. So, Kevin, if anyone can come back from this, he can. You better believe it. Outstanding, David. Thank you. Let's check out Indiana's starting lineup. Sabonis and Turner up front. Oladipo is the two with Warren playing small forward. And it's McConnell in at the one. And for Miami. In the middle, it's Olenek and Adebayo. Filling out the wings, it's Waiters and Butler. And it's Dragic in at the one spot. And the Pacers start off with the ball. McConnell scanning the floor. Oladipo outside. Outside Warren. Six on the shot clock. The shot that time, not on target. Some solid defense from Butler. And here is Waiters. And the foul on Victor Oladipo. That is his first foul of the game. That's something you hate. You're trying to come in with an aggressive mindset, and that early foul could take you right out of it. Brogdon, he's checked in for T.J. McConnell. Now, here's Adebayo. Stolen by Brogdon. And up the court come the Pacers on the break. It's Autobio with the rebound. From 11 feet away, no good from Trogic. Here's Oladipo. It's tipped. They retain possession. They shoot again. It's hauled in by the Heat. Yeah, trying to get going here, but that's an offer for the first five here to start the game. Dragic gets the bucket. He's letting someone else be the catalyst. Goran Dragic has been working on his catch-and-shoot game. I've been against Dragic, and he makes that one. Just setting the tone with an aggressive move to the rag and, and where's the help defensively no excuse you have to be aware he should be on your radar all the time now here's waiters turner with the steal whistle blows basket is good so a chance here for a three-point play yeah exceptional play there to take the ball and still get it to fall the base are shooting their first foul shot of the night That free throw good from Warren. Just about two minutes into the game, first quarter of basketball. Rock gets the pass to Olenek. Warren against Butler. From 11 feet away, shots good by Waiters. The screen and roll, a simple play to run, but when executed properly, as Waiters did, it's a nightmare to defend. Now here's Turner. Here's Warren. The shot misses. Some solid defense from Butler. For the three. And it goes out of bounds. That went off Dragic. Now, Oladipo. We're about three minutes into this first quarter, and it's tonight. And they funk this quarter. He's trying to shoot his way out of it. And then Waiters with the jam. 
Dion gets it going in the open court. A dangerous score when he has space to work with. Oladipo outside. Yep, that one goes in there. And after missing four straight, he finally gets one to go. And it's Dragic bringing up the ball for the Heat. Passes it to Butler. And the call will be against Sabonis. That is his first foul of the game. And the Heat making a change here. Winslow's checked in. The Pacers also with a sub. Holiday's checked in. First quarter play and uh, just over three and a half minutes in. And he gets the bucket. And really the improvement as a finisher is noticeable for Kelly Olynyk. Pass to Warren. It's over Olynyk. Warren, good. Warren's got five. When the defense is non-existent like they were there, it's pretty easy to score like he did. Dragic against Holiday. It's Dragic with the drive. Here's Holiday. And the pass to Turner. It's deflected, but he recovers it. Pass to Warren. Six to shoot. Holiday with the three. Sinks the three-pointer. Defensively, a breakdown along the perimeter. Just too slow to rotate. Gets the pass to Autobahn. Winslow against Warren. Inside, Olenek. Nice D from Sabonis. Needing right at the rim. He typically converts in those situations. Not this time. Bounce pass from Warren. Passes it to Sabonis. Warren against Dragic. Fires from deep. Goran Dragic grabs the board. The Heat trail by three. That one drops and he's got two for five. Bouncing off defenders like a pinball. Something we see from Dragic almost every night. Warren against Winslow. Warren with the ball. He has five. From deep. Offensive rebound. And that one released in time, but no good. One quarter in the books, and it's been a close one so far. Pacers lead by one. Back after this from the American Airlines Arena. Jimmy Butler, a hard worker on the floor and off the court as well, possesses a unique individuality. I worked extremely hard to get where I am today, so whenever you walk to my house, you see a really big, some may call it obnoxious, uh, boombox aquarium, but I love music. I don't really watch too much TV. It's always music, so it's just another thing to remind me, continue to be who you are. Just have fish inside of it. A boombox aquarium, huh? <laughs> Points for originality, Greg. Butler, not shy, breaking from convention, beats to the rhythm of his own drum. And we're ready to get back into the action here in game one. Let's see what this quarter has in store for us. And when you consider how the Pacers are doing, guys, what do you think? Showing a lot of confidence in their rotation. They went right to that bench when they need a point. This is where you credit the guys in the front office for going out and getting you the pieces you need. On the court for the Pacers as our second quarter gets underway. We've got Doug McDermott, Jeremy Lamb out there with Leaf, and it's Bitadze in at the five, roaming the paint. Here's Leaf. Yep, it goes in, and the Miami lead is cut down to just one on the basket from Holiday. One sign of a great playmaker hitting his man in stride. Here's Hero, covered by Lamb. Winslow kicks to Johnson. Over Lamb. Misses off the right iron. 
And so Holiday will bring it up for Indiana. Second quarter, we're a little over a minute and a half in. McDermott passes to Holiday. Lamb with the ball. It's guarded by Johnson. They get it back. Ijadze. Good timing by Justice Winslow with the long arm to get a hand on that shot. Leaf gets to Holland. Pass to Lamb. Outside Holiday. Over Jones. Holiday gets the bucket. Holiday's got four points in the quarter. Several lead changes going on here in the early portion of this game. Yeah, it reminds me of that cameo song, Back and Forth. A nice shot by Winslow. And they are attacking the rim and getting great results. Holiday against Winslow. Now the pass to Leaf. Kicks it to Lamb. Turn over the 24-second buzzer, signaling the shot clock violation. Oladipo, he's checked in for Indiana. And for those of you just joining us in the second quarter, with about three minutes gone by, Leonard, the pass to Hero. Winslow against Holiday. Winslow kicks to Leonard. From outside, off the mark. The defense got lucky there. That's one you expect him to bring. And we'll see if they can finally hold on to a lead. It's been back and forth all night. Both teams putting forth their best efforts right now. This is the kind of game fans pay to see. Here's Hero. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. Waiters, he's checked in for Miami. Turner's checked in for Indiana. Malcolm Brogdon comes in for Aaron Holiday. And here in the second quarter of action, as we approach four minutes played, Winslow, the pass to Hero. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's Waiters. Again, the miss by the Heat. Indiana leading. Outside, Lamb. Johnson against Brogdon. And Oladipo has it in the corner. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. His struggles from the field continue, yet they still hold the lead. Johnson surveying the floor. To the middle, there's Winslow, and the dunk by Winslow. We're going to see a lot of this from Winslow in the coming years. Explosive young talent. Here's Leaf. The shot, no good. Good D by Johnson. He'd have gone four of seven from the field in this second quarter so far. Hero, no good. And I'm sure next time he sits down, coach is going to have a few choice words for him with that shot selection. And you know what? He knows it. You have to try to play within the system or you're going to come away with empty possessions. And a new group in for the Heat. Adebayo is checked in for Leonard. Kelly Olenek comes in for Johnson. Butler, he's checked in for Hero. And it's Trogic in for Winslow. Indiana also making some changes. Zabonis comes in for Leaf. And Warren subbed in for Jeremy Lamb. Butler against Brogdon. Oladipo outside. Tires the three. Hits it from three-point range. Oladipo's got seven points. It has been nip and tuck through the first half. Exactly, guys. The way it's seesawed back and forth, unbelievable. There's a four-second difference from the shot clock to the game clock. Here's Brogdon, and it's Drogic with the rebound. Offensively, that's how you want to end the possession, except for the result. Now here's Butler. Back to Drogic. Out of bounds, Indiana takes possession. And some good action through the first two quarters as we reach halftime. It's the Pacers. They're up by two. It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. 
Kevin, thanks. Here with Jimmy Butler. Jimmy, you have come a long way in this league. When you look at your career now versus when you came in, how different is it? Much different. Um, I think on the floor, I'm supposed to do a lot more on both ends of the floor. And um, off the floor, I think it's still the same. People recognize my hair. <laughs> well, it is a unique style. Jimmy, thanks a lot. Back to you, Kevin. Thanks for the great interview, David. And we'll be back for the third quarter of basketball following halftime. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Well, there's a definite postseason buzz in the air. Welcome back, everybody. Ernie Johnson, Kenny Smith, and Shaquille O'Neal. Checking out the Pacers, they hung tough in what was a closely contested first half. If what we've seen in game one so far is any indication, we're going to have quite a series on our hands. And Kenny, what do you think about what we saw from Indiana? Well, there was a big spark from the bench in the first half. Sometimes you're hoping for your reserves to come in and just hold court, but they didn't do that. They actually got better. And Shaq, your thoughts on the Heat? Well, a lot of their points came in transition. They dictated the pace of the game. It was a fast pace. Put the defense back on its heels. I say keep attacking the second half. Do not slow down. And that wraps up the halftime show. Third quarter set to begin in just a few. doesn't get much better than playoff basketball. Let's get back to the action here in round one. Miami trailer. Filling out the wings, it's Waiters and Butler. In the middle, it's Olenek and Adebayo. And it's Dragic in at the point. That's the group in the game for the Heat. Shot clock at six. Here's Butler. Nice jump shot. Good. Butler's got it all tied up now for Miami. I like the way he came off that pick. Been able to stay on balance, rise up, and knock down the shot. Oladipo outside. Three-pointer connects from three-point range. Oladipo's got the lead up to three now for the Pacers. Yeah, that's two bombs in a row from long range. Waiters dishes to Butler. He kicks to Dragic. A 15-footer, and it's off the back rim. No good. And so it's Turner with it. He brings it up for the Pacers. Pass to McConnell. And here's Sabonis. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring hit from him. On its way from Oladipo for two. And Butler sends it back. One of the most versatile defenders we have in the league. Butler's reach also allowed him to get that block. Derek Jones, he's checked in for a limit. Aaron Holiday's checked in for the Pacers. Just over a minute and a half have passed here in the third quarter. Hate to see that. I know everyone's mind is on the play, but you've got to protect the ball. The Heat trail by three. Waiters passes to Autobahn. Addition out to Dragic. Outside Butler. This one for three. It's rebounded by Indiana. Turner's got his seventh rebound here tonight. He has hold it go on the wing. He's guarded by Dragic. Count that one. Man, I'll tell you, when you get your floater game going, it's a tremendous weapon. Passes it to Waiters. A three. But they recover it. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. The physicality of Jimmy Butler poses so many issues for defenders. Miami shooting their first free throws of the game on this trip to the line. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First one falls for him. What I like about Jimmy Butler, he excels on both ends of the floor. A different look for Miami. 
Myers Leonard. He's checked in for Otto Bayer. Hero comes in for Waiters. And Winslow subbed in for Goran Dragic. Indiana also making some changes. TJ Leafs checked in for Miles Turner. McDermott comes in for TJ Warren. And it's Lamb in there for Victor Oladipo. Here's Hero. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. There's the three. Again, the miss by the Heat. Pacers leading by four. Lamb finds Holiday. The Lamb. And the foul called on Myers Leonard. That is his first foul of the game. The Heat making a switch here. Johnson's checked in. And a change for the Pacers. Brogdon, he's checked in for Aaron Holiday. Here's Lamb. Has to be Johnson. Indiana moving the ball over. Pocket six. And there's the foul on the shot. He'll go to the line for two. Clearly a foul. The Pacers shooting their second and third free throws tonight. And the first one at the line is good. Brogdon hits them both. We've seen him put a lot of pressure on the defense and then cash in at the line. Left side, Leonard. There's Winslow. That's good, and it's Leonard with the assist. Six points for Justice Winslow. With Winslow, physical play doesn't necessarily take him out of his rhythm. Locked in against Winslow. Brockton outside. Just five on the clock. And the Pacers can't get it to go. Not sure if that's the shot you were looking for, but it's a fairly clean look. Almost have to take it. Oh, just solid on the one-handed slam. And guys, when it's a tight ball game like this, he's the guy they want with the ball. Now, here's Brogdon. Knocks down the three ball. Lamb's got himself on the board with three there. And it looks like they left their defensive effort back in the locker room, guys. They just haven't had the same commitment here defensively in the second half. Here's Jones. He's got six. Here's Hero. Back to Jones. Shoots. And with that shot, the Indiana Leafs cut down now to just three on the basket from Winslow. I can't believe that went in, and I don't think he can either. So timeout called here, the first for Indiana. Kelly Olenek checked in for the Heat. Sabonis, he's checked in for the Pacers. T.J. Warren comes in for Doug McDermott. And Lamb kicks to Brockton. He dishes it to Warren. Out to Lamb. Brockton the pass to Sabonis. And a great assist by Brockton as that one goes in. And the Pacers lead by five. Miami's gotten blank from three-point land so far in the third. Still 0 for 3. Winslow, the bounce pass. Hero, off target with his three. And gotta like what they've been doing down low in the post. 
Warren, the pass to Sabonis. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. The Pacers shooting their fourth and fifth attempts at the free throw line tonight. Free throw, no good. And some changes here for the Heat. Bam out of bios checked in for Johnson. And it's Drogic in for Derek Jones. Indiana also making some changes. Miles Turner, he's checked in for TJ Leaf. And it's Victor Oladipo in for Lamb. And he's good on the second. The Heat trail by six. A, a quick, good shot here, and they can go two for one. Trying to squeeze out every extra possession, but they have to work fast. Turner with the steal. Warren finds Oladipo. They grab their own miss. And the shot by Warren, no good. And there's the pass to Olenek. Near the three-point line, it's Dragic. Misses there. And so it's Indiana with their lead standing at six points here at the end of the quarter. Looking good at this point, but wanting more. And we'll be back with you shortly. And now we have a moment to uh, reveal our State Farm assist of the game. And, and I'm glad this was the pick because I love this pass. Such a great dish. That's what I call court vision. Yeah, you also have the location of the pass. Puts it right where it needs to be, where his man can do something with it. NBA playoffs round one. Thanks for joining us as we get back to the action on the court. Our fourth quarter action underway presented by Gatorade. All fueled up and ready to go. Let's reset the lineups. On the court right now for the Pacers. Oladipo is the two with Warren playing small forward. Sabonis and Turner up front. And it's Brogdon in at the point. Indiana leading by four. Oladipo outside. To Warren. And Winslow pulls it down. Trying to finish out the game strong. You have to recognize who has the hot hand and get him the ball. Butler, he's checked in for Justice Winslow. And uh, Miami shooting 47% from the floor. Getting it done. Waiters surveying the D. It's stolen by Oladipo. And here's the fast break. Oladipo leading the way. Love the recognition. Realizes that one is all him. Sometimes that's the call. You want to be unselfish, but even more so, you want to be effective. Now Drogic. Six on the shot clock. And it's sent back by Turner. Butler from outside. He hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. Oh, big time put back there. What a great motor on this guy. There is no one who goes after those rebounds harder. Passes to Oladipo. This quarter of play, about two minutes in now. Bounce pass from Warren. Turner dishes to Warren. Poked away and stolen by Butler. A nice ball movement here by the Heat. And it's in there. Now just a two-point Indiana lead. Butler has come a long way with his ball now. He has a few tricks he can pull off from time to time to score. Oladipo taking his time here. A three from Warren. Rebound by the Heat. You know, we talk a lot about scoring efficiency. He's displaying the exact opposite to tie it up. Trying to get up and is out of bio. Count the basket and the foul. It's going to be on Victor Oladipo. Oh. 
the side. And the free throw is good, now leading by one. Deion Waiters should be a great free throw shooter. He has high arc, good touch, maybe just lack of focus at times. Time call here. Indiana decides to talk it over. Trying to find some answers offensively. Yeah, these guys need to work together as a team, as a unit. Try and carve out some easy buckets. go to the sideline and catch up with our Hall of Famer, David Aldridge. Hey, guys. Well, Nate McMillan had some advice from the team during that last break. He got on his guys about allowing too many paint points. He said, hey, we've got to be scrappy. We've got to be quicker to help, quicker to collapse the lane. You guys know what to do. Now you got to give me the effort. I want to see some nasty. Kevin? Here's Waiters following the basket by T.J. Warren. Butler with the ball. Victor Oladipo grabs the miss. He looked just a little out of rhythm. He's still trying to establish consistency from there. Warren finds Oladipo. Launches it. It's Autobio with the rebound. Autobio's got his sixth rebound on the night. Again, the miss by the Heat. Pacers have gone just 33% from the field in the fourth quarter, so they are two of six. It's Brogdon on the wing. He's guarded by Drogic. Sabonis. And chance shot. Some solid defense from Butler. Great defensive effort. Just saved a basket. You know what? This is why you never give up on a play. You don't know what's going to happen. The Waiters believes in himself as a shooter. Makes him more than willing to step up in big moments. Timeout call. The Pacers. They're trailing by two. 135 left in the fourth quarter of this one. and our Jordan player of the game, Justice Winslow. And in terms of his shooting, this has been one of the more accurate performances you'll ever see. I mean, he's been in constant motion, creating a lot of good looks for himself. But, but still, even when you're wide open, you expect to miss some of the time. And that has not been the case here tonight. This guy has made everything. Now, here... And the call the shot that sends him to the line. That went on a limit. Wow, wow, he got whacked on that one. Shouldn't be much debate there. <laughs> he hits the first one, and that narrows the gap to one. Both. 
No doubt about those free throws. This is why you put the ball in his hands. For Miami, they've gone five for nine from the field in the final quarter so far. Butler attacking, and he banks in the layup. And the Heat lead by two. Gigantic bucket from Butler. Close the door on that shot. Oladipo outside. Right on the bucket. Oladipo's got 11 points here in just the second half. And challenging the bigger defender coming through in the biggest moment. You know, it's just a case where you just have to go up strong and live with the results. Nice job. 59 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. Oladipo draws the double. And a bit of a battle here for the ball. The official signals a jump ball here. Pacers now. Out to Turner. Over. Out of bio. Oh, wow. A huge basket to tie the game. Big time basket at a big time moment. This is why we all watch. The NBA is about these moments. Now a timeout called by Miami. to the plate on that one. Game could be on the line right here. It's now or never. There's Oladipo. And that one is off. And it's Miami the other way. Now here's Butler. 12 seconds left to play in the final quarter. Just five to shoot. From deep three-point range. Oh! Able to get a shot off in time and they turn it over a very unfortunate time there to pick up a shot clock violation time called here indiana decides to talk it over they're down by two just two seconds left in the fourth guys your thoughts and with a couple seconds still on the clock i try to get the ball in as close to the basket as possible that way if you miss a quick one you may have time for a putback to tie it at the buzzer So the big win by Miami in a tight game. A uh, pretty good feeling right now for them to be out in front like this in the series. You know, Kevin, momentum is so, so critical. And you know they'll want to ride this wave into game two. And a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge standing by courtside. David. Thank you, Kevin. Jimmy, you have become a star in this league, big part of the team. Have those expectations put more pressure on you individually? Uh, no, no pressure. I think I'm going to do what I do each and every night. I'm not going to play well every night. So I just got to focus on me, this team. I can't worry about the outside force. A real leader, Jimmy. Thank you for your time. Back to you, Kevin. 
All right, David, thank you. And that about wraps it up for this broadcast of the NBA Eastern Conference quarterfinal. For Greg Anthony, Steve Smith, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Have a great evening.